Fidlik, and welcome back to another episode of Monologues. A few things have changed. Uh, I actually recorded this episode. I've went back to a previous seat. Uh, at the end of the last episode, we were getting advanced on by brigands. Now, because I reloaded the save, they actually appeared on the map in a different place, and instead of four units, there's only three, but I think there is a fourth one. They just haven't crossed over here, so they're there. So we've rallied the troops to this area. It means there's going to be dead bodies in the region, which is sad. Why am I writing you so bloody far away? Why are you over here? Yeah, you should be moving. <laughs> you should be moving over there. Oh, I don't know why it says they're here. They should be in the in the manor. But the troops have been rallied, so they are. They should be moving out. I, I can't remember if I built these fields, but yeah, after the end of the last episode, I had, I had a problem where because I focused on barley, trying to get beer in. I didn't have any wheat, and all the food ran out, and for some reason, this entire berry deposit was lost to deforestation, even though I've moved all the deforestation activities completely away from this area. In fact, just to make sure, I'm going to go into logging camp and go advanced and say that you are going to cut trees down over here, very far away from these berries, yet the entire berry thing was lost. So I basically ran out of food, and at the end of the, the episode I recorded, uh, Zwayu was under attack by the dude, Hildebolt. Yeah, Hildebolt was attacking from over in this region. At the end of the last episode, the brigands were coming in from here, and in the recorded episode, I actually defeated them in this valley, which was totally fine, but now they're gonna be coming in from this way. Why the hell did you guys go over there? That's so stupid. That's not where I asked you to go. Anywho, let's push play. The troops... Oh, they're back here. That's fine. The troops should be rallying. Right, get them set up. Uh, can I set them up over there? I don't know which direction these guys are going to come in at. I'd like a thing that showed you shows you where my already placed units sort of are. Uh, have these guys now then. So I have you in the back. Construction of a well was finished. Yeah, it's because stuff literally burned down, which sucked. <laughs> I built new houses. Uh, I built a row of new houses and uh, they, they all caught fire because there wasn't a well for about a thousand miles. Now, I don't know why. I can't... I think 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I think 7 is the max amount of units you can get for a region. I obviously have extra people. Right, now these guys are kind of going to be tired. I don't need want these guys to divert. I want them to come over and fight. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to move them. I'll just have them fight. Yeah, okay, you guys fight them. You guys fight them. You fight them. And you guys fight them. Start attacking them. And you guys start attacking them. Yeah, they're sort of moving, running away. I don't know why. All my troops are very disorganized. Yeah, attack them. I don't know what's going on here. I'm kind of confused. You guys are moving over there. You shouldn't be. Come back over this way. Where's my retinue? Get them into the fray as well. It's still saying that they're over here. Why? I... Okay, so the combat system is kind of broken for me at the moment, which is sad. These guys should be pretty good, though. I just don't want to lose a bunch of archers. That guy's still coming in. 
attack them, you attack them. I don't know what's going on here. Where the hell are you clones going? Get, fight them. You guys get into there as well. I don't want the archers to get hit. And they are getting hit. Because these units are not doing as they are supposed to. Where the hell are you going? Get over there. Right, they're broken, so you come and def defeat them. Now they're sort of moving in, sort of squeamishly, but a lot of archers are dying. Yeah, the combat system still looks like it needs a, a bit of work. Uh, it's pretty broken. None of them actually rallied to where I wanted them to rally. These guys are still sitting over here, and there's 36. What is going on? <laughs> uh, right, you guys fall back. Uh, these archers as well fall back. I lost so much archers, but... Not through any fault of my own. That kind of sucks, because I wanted in this episode to build up the retinue. And then head... Where are you guys? They're still over there. Yeah, they... None of them went to... None of that went to plan. Right, disband them. Just... They, the retinue were useless. At least none of them died. Right, that was... That was completely... Uh, completely terrible. That was. The last time... I absolutely smoked uh, the guys. None of the archers were killed. In fact, I think I only lost two soldiers in the whole skirmish and broke all four brigand units. Yeah, a lot of people will not be returning home to their families. Yeah, it was kind of weird. The Unless I misclicked, but I'm pretty sure I told the retinue to move over here and they summoned over there. Uh, weird. Exposed goods. There should not be any exposed goods anywhere. I actually built another large granary and another large warehouse. And I'm going to throw three people in there to start getting stuff moving. I moved one of the saw pits and built a road over here. And since building the road over to these buildings, they now actually have food and stuff. Which they didn't have before. It was incredibly difficult to level up these buildings. I'm going to keep them at level 2. Although I want to... Are there people here? Yeah, only Margaret. Because it looks like her son and husband were killed. Right, so how is the army looking? Yeah, they've got most of their troops back. I have, I don't have enough pole arms, but I have enough shields and stuff to refill. I just need the people. I need a lot of people. Well, that sucked. That really did suck. But again, I don't think it's through any fault of my own. I have bought in two horses. And they're waiting. Friedlin and Peter carrying a rider, so he's off to get stuff. And I'm now bringing in a lot more food. And I'm trading roof tiles and boots. Because they sell for a lot of money. Which is good. Which is really good. And soon I'll be able to build... I think I was building... Gambeson's tailor shop. Yeah, we're building gambesons, and we're also have an armorer shop in which they are building or making helmets, which is good. So some of these should be kitted out. That's good if I can get them a gear. I've lowered taxes to try and get approval rating up. Yeah, 41, but the people should... Ah, they're gone. They do... The bodies do despawn after time, uh, and it's... It's really useful, actually. 
get them out of there. As soon as it hits September, I'll get the people back in the farms. And we've got a lot of space for new people coming in. Yeah, so this is barley, but a lot of these are wheat now. This one never got sown in time, so that's upsetting. <laughs> and I've got 10 ale. 10 ale is good. I always want to have at least 10 ale. There's two in the tavern, so that's fantastic. And we're making a buttload of coin, which is good as well. Right, so this should regrow. I don't think it'll regrow now. But we should be good, so royal tax increase, that's not good because I'm not paying taxes. I, I'm not bringing in taxes presently. Yeah, I'm 198, 199. Pole arms, 82 of 72, which is weird. So there should be enough pole arms, I just need the people to use them. This unit is back at full strength. Looks like some of them are changing their sort of job occupations. Kind of weird. Yeah, but it looks like men do come back fairly quickly. Right, now each of these should have two livestock. So they should make this quicker. Although there's probably no flax for making gambesons. And as soon as it hits September, I'll get all the people back in here. Growth's at 85%. Ooh, I made 197 mucks, but I think I sold. I think I bought some stuff in. Yeah. We're selling and buying, but I need this food. I think I'm going to start buying apples as well to try and get a bit more variety in. Honey is minus 10. I don't understand why it's minus 10. How could it be minus? How, why do I have three apples? Am I buying apples? Oh yeah, I am buying apples. Well, that's good. Family member joined the brewery. Excellent. I have nine months worth of food, which is fantastic. And we're into September. Right, get all the people back in here. I'm not building anything presently, so I'll just get all the families in there. Right, they'll head out. We used up all the grain and all the flour. So the 750 bread is all we have and we can't make more until we get more sort of grain slash flour etc. But now it's going to be coming in fairly sharpish. There's the barley and then these guys can start the malt and we'll start getting more beer. Right so next year this will be fallow. Or I think it was fallow. I think we're doing barley. This one will be fallow. This one's barley, but next year it will be wheat. So that's fine. Wait, are you doing... Change that to 91%. Okay. Set that to medium. Set them all to medium. Because I want each one to get their sort of fair shake. Now, this year, you are going to be wheat. You're going to be barley, but I'll set crop rotation on. Next year, you're going to be barley. And you're going to be fallow, and you're going to be wheat. Some of these should still be set up for flax, yeah. See, barley is at 16%, but they should be done with that. Uh, 
I don't know what's happening with this. I guess I'll just have to play it through and see how they get on, but it's going to be winter soon, and even with the plowing stations, I think I still need a third farmer's... I'm going to get another. I'm going to get a third farmer, just so I can get... Oh, uh, yeah, farmhouse. And a lot of this area would be good for farming as well. I might clear these trees completely. Advanced. Uh, it's control. Yeah, replant the stuff there, please. Right, what did we get? So they're still plowing and sowing fields. That's good. But we're in October, and then once we get to January, we're pretty screwed. And I'll get a couple of livestock for this. This one should be empty. It is. How are we getting on with this one? Yeah, it's, it's only just being plowed. This one is growing. This one only seems to do this section. It doesn't do the whole field. So I think that field might be broken. No flax this year though. Follow. That's fallow. This one's doing barley. That's good. This one's doing wheat. Wheat. Fallow. Flax. Flax. Wheat. Yeah, we're only going to have a couple of barley fields. I really need this one to get done. Ooh, and the, the crown took money off us. Right, where's everybody gone? Get on this, please. Look at him go. <laughs> Such a weird way to... Now he's on this one. No, he's not. He's totally bailed. Alright, get one, two, three. Build the plowing station. That shouldn't take long to upgrade. Uh-oh, I need to pull a family out of here. Pull the family out of there, get you on building. This is follow, but it shouldn't be. Yeah, I think I screwed up. But we have 235 wheat, we have a bit of barley. Eight months worth of food. That should go up. And we're at 98% on approval, which means I'm going to start getting taxes again. New mercenary companies available, but there isn't. Yeah, I can't build anymore. That's sad. <laughs> I really wanted to build more. So these are all growing which is fantastic this one again like i said it's it's broken it's not doing the whole field and it was like that last year and the year before that's foul that's foul and this is barley there is some wheat coming in though so that's fine and some barley okay so we should be good to go right how's the army looking 36, 36, 36, 36. And we're going to start gaining a little bit more on taxes. Right, you guys. You're upgraded. You're upgraded. So are you, so are you, so are you, so are you. So are you. Hire another one. Upgrade you. Hire another one. Upgrade you. Upgrade you. And I want at least 12. 
A twelve's not a lot. If he comes at me with his retinue, he'll have many companies with at least 24 soldiers in them. But I have enough influence now that I can go and take over Goldhoff. It's got the iron, but the fertility here is appalling. We're going to need rye, so we'd have to do straight off the bat orchardry and the rye cultivation. Probably other food types like honey and trapping. I might even do forest management. You get six points, so one, two, three, four, five, and six. So it'd be one and two, three, four, and five, and then one of these for six. Have you got? 20 of 20 and berries is 0 64 so there's quite a few berries there what about this area yeah you've got clay but we've got clay you do have a rich berry deposit and you've got 20 animals there's a bandit camp here that I could obliterate Right, let's get into the next year. They're sort of working their way through the wheat at the moment. Once this is all converted to grain, we can pull the people out of here. Give me that farmhouse, please. Yeah, they've got four to convert to grain. They're still getting grain in, but I don't know where they're getting it from. Reach, I just got a, an achievement, reach 100% approval in a large town. Well, that's awesome. Yeah, we're basically staying alive on uh, bread here. Are there people in here? There are. Good. Uh, oh, wow, I literally have no living space for anyone else. Right, animals are here. I don't really need any more people. I'll build those houses just because. Right, you guys have got a bit of green, and once that's picked up, we'll be good. Eel is okay. Flowers at 340. That's at least like another 340 bread, and we've got some malt. Shoes is low, but I have been selling a lot of shoes. Roof tile's still at 239, though, so that's awesome. Is there any other food I want to buy in just in case? I think I'm buying everything. Yeah, I have trade routes set up for the lot of it. That's going to cost a lot of money. I'm going to do this. We should be the only buy in if that surplus is not reached. If we go to tab, everybody seems relatively happy. There's a lot of cows coming in here. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> Taxes is good. Can I get the people out here yet? Yes, I can. Right, get you guys out of there. You did great. Well done. You're done as well. Uh, I'm going to buy an ox from there. I'll get one person working in there and I'll assign a livestock to this. So they'll be able to plow stuff even faster. And they'll be able to build this in no time at all. And I'll get eggs and stuff set up here 
straight away. Right, that's Burger's Port Level 1. Let's get that upgraded. Let's get this one upgraded. That one can be upgraded. Start working in some of these houses over the back here. And this one. I've been wanting to get these ones here done for quite a while. That would be nice to get them done. It's a little bit more taxes as well. Approval is good. Lack of entertainment is because there's no ale in the pub. That's always a thing. Eggs is looking pretty good now. The berries get annihilated fairly quickly. I mean, I might start building, like, farms over here. I need to keep this wooded area for them. Might get a farm over here. I might have... No, not you. Are you logging camp? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Advanced. Go and remove the trees from there. And the town is actually looking pretty good. It's looking pretty decent. We've also got our upgraded manor. Construction finished, burgage plot level one. That's good, wherever the hell that is. Yeah, upgrade that one. Royal tax increased 405 bucks. That's brutal. <laughs> Right, so I have space for 138, and I have 129, 134. Are there people in this? People? Yeah, there are. I'm going to have you do... Oh, no, that's, that's not what I wanted. Oh, well. That one's being upgraded. Oh, well, the <laughs> these two houses are being inadvertently upgraded. That one's being upgraded. Let's have a look at some of the ones in the back here. I'll upgrade you. We're in March. So stuff should be growing again. Is there anything I need to trade for? I have 21 spears. Don't really want to sell spears. Everybody has this. We're going to start running out of stuff to sell soon. Could sell planks, but I kind of I need and want planks. Herbs, wool, malt, iron slab, wax, firewood. Almost sells for like a quid. Right, this is full, but they'll work through the flower in no time at all. And, and pretty soon it'll be empty. I'm up to 10 months of food though, that's good. I should have my livestock in here. I do. Let's get another one. Construction of a food stall was finished. I guess that's fine. Right, you. I don't want to upgrade again. <laughs> I want you on vegetables. I want you on vegetables. You on vegetables as well. Because these are sort of larger plots. Just get a ton of vegetables. Am 
Might build a couple more houses, but this will probably be the last. Yeah, build those three, and I'll get, turn these into eggs. I might even get some of them doing goats for a bit more leather. And the rain has ended. Got a bit more cash. I'm gonna upgrade my retinue. Good, good. That's 14. You know what? I'll buy two more. That's 16. Because at the end of this year, I get the feeling that the guy's going to attack again. If I go uh this... Yeah, most of them are getting a at least a couple. But these ones in the middle here are all fine. They're all getting the stuff that they need. Which is awesome. Wish I could upgrade the church again. I guess some of the troops we lost were buried in there. That's fine. That's where they're supposed to be. Gonna throw another person into the clay furnace. Why the hell not? What the hell's going on here? Livestock trading post. Waiting. Waiting for what? You should be assigned to this. Why are there livestock? <laughs> Why are you guys here? You should not be here. Stable space is too... I, I, I maybe have to build another stable. Alright, I'll build one. That's okay. You can have another stable. There's 21 people to build that. That'll be fine. Right, where are my three new mortgage plots? Yeah, you do eggs. You do eggs. And you're going to do goats. Nice. I have zero leather. Yeah, so leather is something we really need. Where are the hunters getting on? There is only one. You only really need one. Alright, we're looking pretty good. We're into me. No sign of the bar and attacking yet, though. Money has gone up, so I'm going to upgrade these guys again. No, no, I don't want to rally them. No, don't rally them. Just get them. <laughs> get them going. I'm just thinking, where do I actually want to... Oh man, fertility is really bad here as well. And here. Oh wow. Yeah, the only thing decent here is like rye fertility. There's a bit of rye fertility here. Whoa, that's rough. <laughs> Down to seven months of fuel. Alright, well, build me. Uh, what am I looking for? Nah, it's not an industry, it's in here. Woodcutter's Lodge. 
Now this is a tiny building. Well, this is just like random ass. Fit in here. You won't fit in there. This has no livestock, because it's a saw pit. <laughs> Alright, well that explains that. You know what? Build it over here. Yeah, I just saw you. You were going to go... Go through road access. We go there. Not enough goods. I, I want to have zero timber. In stock. All right, uh, woodcutters. I have plenty of oxen, so go and cut down stuff there. That's a farmhouse, that's a logging camp. These people are gonna do that. Yeah, I need to keep the corpse fit in the trees there. Zero timber. That's all right. It's because we're going at three times speed now. I sort of took my eye off the ball. But apart from that, we're good. And that's why the firewood is running low. But they'll get to chopping. Wait, did I set them to cut trees down over here? And they should be there. Eight timber, that should start to go up. Get chopping people. I just don't want them cutting down anything over at this side, because it's bad when they do that. Right, we're into July. This stuff's looking good. Still don't know what's happening with this field or why that section there never got planted. But food is my main concern. They can cut firewood all year round. Right, I've got a bit more coin. Full retinue. Good stuff. Alright, we should be pretty well defended here then. And I have a bunch of extra if I need to. I'm at max house limit. I don't think I need any more people. I don't know if more people come in. Do they start to go homeless? I don't really want that to be a thing. I'm happy with the size of this town and I'd like to move on to the next place which even though this place is utter crap for, for stuff that's where I want to go minus 251 just bought a ton of crap there what did you buy? probably booze and iron ore and barley But I'm keeping a constant 9 ale, which is good. Tannery, what are you making? So you're... Weaver's Workshop, what are you making? 
So who makes... Is it in, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, blacksmith joiners. If I go to tab, it doesn't actually tell me one of these guys is making, it's a tailor, tailor's workshop. Yeah, I could have them produce clothes, linen and dyes. I don't have the dyes and cloaks. This they just need linen for. Right, hold on. Dye production is an industry. Workers can fit berries and well I don't want to do that because uh, I need berries to feed my actual people. Right, come on people. Sell some of this crap in here. I think this is starting to slow down. Oh yeah. That's good. Large storehouse still full of stuff. Plenty of sidearms. I might start selling some of them. How much is left in here? Oh, still a lot. Alright, we're in September. Get everyone in there. Get everyone in there. And I've got one labourer dude left. Population is 444. <laughs> Look at them go. Nice. Because I think we used all the flour we did, so we're basically burning through all the other stuff. But we're getting a bit of flax in, which means some of these guys should start to get more gambesons on the go. Which is awesome. gonna start running out of money once the roof tiles disappear all requirements are not met the requirements are met here though oh you're not doing anything <gasps> let's get you on goats all right then upgrade this place that one's done, so upgrade that place. Yeah, you're still having that weird food stall difficulty over there. So are these people. No beer, you see. There is three ale. I don't know what's happening with the herbs. The herbs are, I find the herbs kind of weird. This one should be on. Well, it's on flax. Yeah, I've seen, I've seen another thing there. But there should be sh there should be so much people working in the fields now. All this should get done. They're only doing this part. I need you to actually do the thing you're supposed to do there, game.
Don't just do that part, do the whole field. They are doing the whole field. I think that field was glitched out and it was causing, it was causing issues. Right, it's October, they should get that done. This one's foul, this one's flax and it's not been started yet. This one's fallow, but yet it's been ploughed. Wheat, wheat, fallow, barley, barley, barley. Alright, they're getting crap done now, they're doing this one. I guess they were waiting for an ox to do that one. Alright, that's fine. So are the two... There's still an ox here. <laughs> Why is there still an ox here? <laughs> Upgrade that. Alright, let me look at my food situation. Food is good. Firewood should start to come back online. Ah, yeah. That's good. There's tons of wheat and stuff in, so that should keep food going up. Money is going down. I guess we just don't have that much stuff to sell. Now we'll go with the weapons because... Now there's 58, the shields and stuff just aren't getting across. Well then keep upgrading houses for coin. Maybe try some of the ones over here. Ooh, enemy presses claim. Okay, so they're coming in from... So they are claiming Zvayu. Which is my territory. Alright. So, we'll resolve this claim on the battlefield, and we'll see how we get on. If he throws a ton of troops at us, we're going to be fairly screwed. Uh, we'll have to wait and see how this plays out. Are all the fields done? They are. They are growing. Yeah, that's growing, that's perfect. That's growing, that's perfect. Th these are all done, which is ace. They just need to move the stuff out, but the men will have to go off to war. Which kind of sucks. But we'll leave it there for that episode. The fight for Zvayu will continue, uh, continue in the next episode. But that's been it for me. If you did watch this and you'd like to leave a like, comment, or dislike, please feel free to do so. And if there's more you'd like to see in the future, then hit that subscribe button. But I've been Danny, man. This has been Manor Lords, and I will catch you later.